it's your boy back again, back again, it's your boy, Pimp Daddy, Apple, Cinnamon, or Steve, or Stevas, or PDAC, or PDA Cinnamon, whatever's your flavor, how's everybody doing, I've been dodging raindrops this whole week, and I'm gonna make my way off to some roadside attractions, first stop, we're going to Pony Henge, and then I'm gonna book it to Ban Croft Castle. Pony Henge, as you'll see shortly see, is a collection or a circle of right on ponies, toy ponies, wooden ponies, stuff like that in a circle similar to Stonehenge. Not with any astronomical like significance or anything, I think it's just there. And people have just been steadily adding to it. I don't really know much about it, I've only recently heard about it. Bancroft Castle is um, basically in the 18, late 1800s this dude was building a retirement home <clears throat> and unfortunately he died before he got a chance to use it. So then it became uh, a small sanitarium or sanatorium whatever it's called and it still stands there today in ruin I guess after a fire it was left abandoned where it was used as like some kind of cellar of some sort I don't really know too much. I'm not a historian out here guys. I just ride bikes and like to go to weird places. And I like to take you all along. I didn't realize it at the time, but I'm actually in coffee. I think I'm passing through like, I think on my right is all like the, the historical stuff like Oh, besides like these really nice houses, I'm pretty sure like Uh, Old North Bridge is somewhere around here, I might have passed it I'm not really sure to be honest Oh, this is downtown, so yeah, I definitely passed all that stuff, it's still pretty cool Made it here to Pony Henge. Nobody's sure where they came from, who started it, but people have been adding to it. And it's a weird little stop along the way. A friend of mine did a short 24 hour film here to the middle of this really nice farmland. It's really neat. Cool to finally see it. This one one here is probably my favorite one. Pretty sure when I was a kid, he had one something kind of like this. Just neat, weird, and out of the way.
So after that nice stop in Pony Ponyhenge, I'm gonna try to check out Bancroft Castle. I don't know a lot about it. Apparently some dude put together a castle. I'm gonna have to look it up and probably get the overdub for that. I don't even know if I'm like allowed to park in the trail that I parked at and I'm hoping I don't get in too much trouble, but we'll see what happens. I mean, I'll eat a ticket. It's not like they can tow me out of there. <laughs> Legit. So now I'm just on some trails. If anything, this little excursion was worth it for the for the really nice country view, country roads, and the immaculate views. Oh, speaking of which, okay. Oh. That is something. What a view. <laughs> That's what riding motorcycles is all about. Getting lost in the country, looking for stuff like this. Let's see if we can find this remnants of this castle. And just like that, it looks like I found it. Coming out of the grass. Looks like some people are already there taking a look at it too. Oh, That's amazing. Hi, how you doing? I don't know who these people are. Also some intrepid explorers, I imagine. Wow, it's pretty sick. How often do you get to see the castle? Just chilling in New England. This must have been the basement. It appears someone left some high heels here. I wonder if it's some kind of tribute of some sort.
thank you for watching. That was again Pony Henge and Bancroft Castle. Oh man, this has been a lot of fun. I got more road size attraction. I can't wait to share with you guys. I can't wait to see. Thank you for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe. Follow me at PDA underscore cinnamon on everything. And we'll see you every Tuesday at 5 p.m. Love you all. Ride in. Be safe.